Well, we are back with a health alert for you. Many of us use styrofoam every single day. Maybe you drink your coffee in a cup yeah. made of styrofoam or takeout or leftovers. Yeah, it's really well known that it's not great for the environment, but we don't talk about what it does to your health. That's right. So Crystal Harper spoke with a holistic doctor in Virginia Beach who says that you should stop using it right now. After I finished my own battle with cancer, I started researching steps I could take to prevent it from ever coming back. One of the things I found shocked not only me, but many of my coworkers. People should avoid it because it is carcinogenic. It's something many of us use every single day. It can disrupt your hormonal system. It lasts forever and it's everywhere. It's toxic to our genes, meaning it will damage the code that we have within each of us. We're talking about styrofoam, or properly known as polystyrene. It was invented in the 1940s to insulate buildings, and now many of us are eating from it. It's made cheaply, so of course you can cut a lot of costs. Although we're saving money, we could be paying for it with our health. According to the National Toxicology Program, the chemical styrene may be leached into our food and drinks when we use polystyrene containers. It's a mutagenic type of chemical. Mutagenic means it can change the way our DNA expresses itself. There's been a lot of studies where it has been correlated to a lot of cancers. Dr. Jane Dabu from Lotus Acupuncture says you should avoid polystyrene foam completely. But if you must use it, should avoid anything with a high temperature, hot foods, um, oily foods, um, acidic foods, tomato based, citrus beverages, probably even coffee too, so that's a hot beverage, alcohol. And especially stay away from microwaving it. There's a lot of things you can do besides choosing styrofoam. It's just in our brains, that's what's right there, that's what's available. But if you just are a little more conscious and dig further, you can find a lot of things out there. Styrene can also be found in some plastic containers. Look for the little recycle triangle on your bottles, and if there's a number six in it, that denotes that it is made with the chemical. In studio, Crystal Harper, 13 News Now.